I've been getting so many requests of people wanting to see my braces or see the retainers that I have. So I figured what's better than me just making a video about it. So I'm actually stuck with two. <laughs> Two different retainers. One is permanent and one I just have to wear every single night. So the first retainer is my permanent one. This one I am stuck wearing for pretty much ever and it's glued to the back four of my upper teeth. I don't have one on my bottom, just my uppers. I got this retainer right when my braces came off and this was to prevent my front teeth from shifting. My teeth used to be very, very crowded and I was so afraid that it would end up trying to shift back to that and it actually, once you get your braces off, your teeth do want to shift back to the way they were. So if you are, when you're told to wear a retainer, wear exactly how your doctor tells you to wear it. A lot of people might have questions of if it bothers your tongue, your mouth, or anything like that. And it really doesn't. Um, I can floss, I can do everything that I normally would be able to do and it doesn't affect my tongue. I don't have any sores or anything like that. So honestly, you really can't tell that you have it and people, when they look at you, they can't see that you have it. It has, however, given me a little lisp, but I'm getting used to it and I'm starting to talk way better than I used to talk with it. And it was my choice to get this retainer. Um, my ortho said that I could either get it or I could just not and then wear the second type of retainer that I'll be showing you guys later. But I opted into this because I am so afraid that my teeth are going to go back to the way they were. Like I have nightmares about it and I just really wanted to ensure that that did not happen again. My recommendation is just be sure when you brush, you brush it thoroughly. You don't want bacteria building up or anything like that because... <laughs> My next retainer that I have to wear, and this retainer I only have to wear at night, it's, it kind of, it looks just like the Invisalign retainers, and I'm supposed to wear this every single night, however, I am a bad girl and sometimes I wear it every other night, and what I've noticed is when I kind of skip one night, my top teeth are fine when I put the retainer back in, but when I put it back in my bottom, you can really feel it pull and... It's just not that comfortable, so I should be wearing it every night, but I just kind of don't. <laughs> this retainer doesn't hurt at all. Um, I don't want to put it in on camera because when you take it out, you always have saliva and ugh, I'm not doing that on camera. And what you might be able to see in the picture of my clear braces is the bottom one is not that straight. Yeah, so my bottom one is not perfectly straight because I was kind of forced to get my braces off a little bit early um, because I was moving from New York down here to Charlotte and I didn't really want to have to start the whole process over and switch orthodontists and stuff like that. So I was like, you know what, people can't really see my bottom teeth, they're not that bad, so I just had them take it all off together. So this is what my teeth currently look like. My top teeth are... I mean, they're perfectly straight, but my bottom teeth are a little bit crooked. So there are many different ways that you can clean your clear retainers. Um, you can soak them in a cup with the denture cleaner. That works perfectly. They also make some um, cleaners specifically for retainers that you can soak it in and that makes it easier as well. Or you can do what I do and I just kind of brush them all the time. Um, every now and then I'll soak them in a little bit of mouthwash. But warning, don't soak them in a mouthwash that is blue or green or any sort of color because the plastic will absorb that color and it'll just start looking kind of funky and it won't be too clear anymore. <laughs> so I want to thank you guys so very much for visiting my channel again. Or if this is your first time, then welcome. I really hope you guys will give me a thumbs up if you like this video. Um, leave me a comment if you want to talk and subscribe if you're not already. So until next time, guys. Bye! <laughs>